How I put girls on to anime. A video I have made in the past called The Lust I Got Caught and make sure to check out that video in the description. Now, one of my exes tried to get back with me after I blew up and became this internet celebrity. She was wondering like, yo, how I get to know him? What do I do? Like, where do I go to find the stuff that he likes, you know? So, this is kind of fun because this is the hot public girl in school and when I got out is when anime blew up in popularity I just happened to be on it. So, her friends tried to figure out a way to sabotage me and bring me down. So, how the story really happened was she picked up anime just so she can get to know me personally and she ended up you know falling in love with anime and she went through a little bit of social terror because of the fact that they didn't like something that was so weird and she was watching it you know on her off time when she didn't have homework and stuff but what happened was she was on anime heavy so she started introducing it to her friends and Basically, she wanted everyone to experience it with her, so she made sure everybody got high. <laughs> she was already a piehead, yeah, so it was kind of crazy because uh, the stereotype for anime at that point between her social group was no more. Because when she was at the party, she was watching Naruto, and so how they got hooked on anime was and they were high as fuck, and Itachi's episode comes in. When he's fighting with Kisame, and they're all like, oh my god, he's so fucking hot! What the fuck is this? Oh my god! And, and they were just going crazy, you know? And so word got out to other bitches, like hood bitches, and bitches started watching anime over and over again, you know? Bitches started leaking up for anime rappers just to make me jealous, in fact. It was kind of funny because, you know... She comes from a generation where it's like, anime used to be weird? How? Like, it's so freaking cool, you know? And it, it, it's so crazy because this is, <laughs> if you watched the previous video, you have to understand that this girl was heavy and when I was an anime nerd, I felt like she was out of my league. But once I started to get popularity and fame and she started begging for my attention, she started digging in for research of how to make me and her a little bit closer so what happened was this it carried on to my job and how i put girls on the am at my job i talked to a girl at my job and she literally starts watching anime but what she does is I already have a friend who watched anime at work so she starts hanging out with that guy he asks hey what anime does he watch she started watching those animes Another good way to let people know that I got girls into anime due to a popular trend, not due to the nerd stereotype that they didn't know they had, was when I blew up at FAMH 2018, where she came disguised as my favorite character from My Hero Academia. I was already talking to her, and as soon as she heard me blow up, she came at me the next day, and so... If it was going to be any character from My Hero, it was Todoroki, and that was hella cool, you know? So, but I felt like that was like the only one like she really got into, but you know, as word got out, anime started to get a little bit more popular, but it wasn't at the tier it was because the stereotype was still there. And the reason why it was still there was because they didn't know about the other things it came with. But I still put a lot of more girls that weren't originally interested. One of the biggest things that made anime and girls blow up was I started watching Yu-Gi-Oh! GX back when I blew up. And on my IG story, and so everybody started saying, oh my god, that girl is so hot. I'm talking about Alexis Rhodes here. And every single Alexis in town started to come up to me because I was so famous and because I was really feeling that show. It became so popular to a point where there's a girl that applied for the same job that I did with the same name Alexis. That's so she can come up and get at me. This video is referencing how I got a couple of the stereotypical girls that you wouldn't probably imagine liking anime, watching anime, but, you know, 
another good thing about this was the fact that why a lot of the same stereotypical girls do not watch anime is because of the nerds. The nerds of anime will still turn hood bitches off, you know. It literally came down to the to the point that, you know, I was already popular and they were doing it for clout, but they were also doing it, you know, out of, like I said earlier, the lust that got caught in. This is a video that will be expanded upon in a future and series of videos, but please note that this is the beginning of a lot of other references from my channel that has already been stated called the Dark Game Book. Another great example is in the current chapter, I state how a girl who used to clown me in high school started imitating the animes I watched and saying that, well, would you play tennis with me? She tried to get people to play tennis with her in real life from watching The Prince of Tennis just because she wanted to fit in and it didn't turn out too well. But that is also another reason why you need to check out my playlist called The Dark Game Book. On the contrary, while one girl went all out to try to watch anime, the other girl was complaining of why do I still like this shit? And you guys gotta understand that because I was popular is the only reason why I broke these specific girls and their stereotypes. And my first girl, my ex, who I referenced in this video was getting so desperate. She hacked my phone and she, she downloaded the Kiss anime app. This is an insider. She put a lot of girls onto the animes I watch, you know. So she started sending girls out to get me, and that's one of the examples of how you can, you know, get other people in her social group to interact with your activities. But overall, I'd have to say that that is how I put a specific number of people who don't fit the stereotype, the hood type you would say they're hood rats to watch anime.